Greetings, everybody. We have released the 2019 edition of Coin Manage. Right now, we have the USA and the deluxe versions out. We'll have the Canada and the UK version out in the, in the next week or two. And um, what have we added to the 2019 edition? First, as always, we've added uh, images of the latest USA and Canadian coins. Uh, most of the new images, as usual, are from um, US Mint products, proof sets, things like that, Canadian collector coins. We have introduced what I think is a very useful new report to the program. It's uh, basically the coin, a list of coins that you own sorted by value. So you're going to see your most valuable coins first. And um, the way you run that is if you want to run it for all your coins in your inventory, you just select reporting. And then it's going to be under um, coins owned most valuable first. And as you can see here, it shows the listing of all your coins. Uh, and the right hand right hand most column is the value and it's sorting in descending order so your most valuable coins show up uh, first now you don't have to run this coin on your entire inventory what you can do is uh, like all reports they're uh, context sensitive so let's say I've got two collections here one for client one for myself and I just want to run the report on uh, my clients collection what I can do is a right mouse click select output report using and again select coins owned most valuable valuable first and it's just going to show the coins in the client's collection now speaking of uh, context sensitivity um, we've always had a boolean coins report and boolean summary and what we've done is we've made those context sensitive as well so uh, what you can do now is right mouse click select, select output report using and you're going to see the boolean coins and the boolean summary and they're just going to show the uh, summary as as always, just for the uh, the currently selected collection country. Uh, oh, it goes down to the type level. Another new feature we've added is also related to Boolean coins. What we've done is in the other Boolean Boolean coin section, we've added quite a few new listings of uh, worldwide Boolean issues. For example, the Chinese pandas, uh, Krugerrands, Mexico 50 peso gold coins. So let's see if you get a stash of uh, 20 Mexico 50 peso gold coins, which would be great. Uh, you can just go ahead and um, just manually enter the quantity 20 and select Boolean value. Each one, each one is going to be worth 1545. Hit, hit uh, apply. They've been added to the inventory. And let's see if you get some Krugerrands, half an ounce of gold. You got three of those. Four of those click OK and uh, it's a, as you can see it's a very very quick way to inventory all your bullion coins from all over the world so I've given you a couple of new features in the 2019 edition we've also uh, made quite a few other smaller changes uh, for example get a new version of the of the report designer and it's going to generate your, your reports about 20% up to 20% faster uh, the report designer will start up faster if you're editing reports um, and we another feature uh, customers were asking for is when you're installing the program you can now select which uh, which folder and drive the stock images are going to appear on before it would always uh, show up on your default drive which is usually your c drive and we now support uh, uh, scanning pcgs slab barcodes with a plus grade for example ms66 plus uh, there's there's some other uh, uh, bug fixes and things like that as well. Okay, thank you very much for watching. Take care and goodbye.